Hey there, welcome and welcome back. I hope everybody's doing good out there today. Um, today I'm going to be doing a patron shout out request for um, Bruno. He wanted me, he just told me to pick a bandmate song. Um, now, <laughs> that's more work than you than you think, Bruno. Um, there's not very many bandmate songs that have, haven't already been requested by a bunch of people. And I'm trying to keep my patron shout outs to where it's just for you guys. The, you know, the, the patron um, requested it. So I scoured their channel and there's only one video, that they, or one song that hasn't been requested so far and it's called Memorable. Um, this will be the official music video. Um, the thumbnail, I'm not sure what kind of song it's gonna be. The thumbnail has just Miku like outside in this beautiful sunny day with uh, acoustic guitar. So I'm not sure if it's going to be a big song, if it's going to be my, if it's a ballad or some of some sort. But I'm super interested because I love everything band made. You guys know it. Um, they're such a great band, but I can't not watch them. Um, I've actually been watching. I've watched probably 20 or more um, reactions to Hate in the last like three days. For some reason, they're popping up on my um, feed, and I love that song. I love the battle the Misa um, Konami battle so I um, I love seeing people see that for the first time like I did but I've been watching that song over and over and over and over again on with reactions for the last like three two or three days um, I can't get enough of Bandmaid I love this band they are absolutely amazing um, thank you Bruno um, you have been, you are my very first patron. You've been with me from the beginning. I appreciate all the support you've given me and your, all your um, super supportive comments talking about how you feel that you, you like how I do my, how I run my channel, that I'm, you know, I'm not pushing just for likes and clicks and stuff. Although I love those, don't get me wrong, like and comment. But I do. I love listening to stuff that other people aren't. That's why I put out so many videos, because I want to put out lots of popular videos. But I also want to put out stuff that other you know people are requesting that probably aren't going to get the views. And I understand that, and now I'm just going to live with that. Um, but Bandmate is not one of those. Bandmate always gives me good <laughs> good views. I'm happy about that because they are of the all the bands that I've found so far. They're top tier. I mean, I, I, I'm not gonna say they're the apps, my absolute favorite because there's two or three others that I absolutely can't get enough of, as, just as much as Bandmade. Um, but Bandmade is in that absolute top tier. I love this band. These ladies are amazing. I cannot wait till they tour the US again. I would give anything to be able to go to um, Japan and go to that show with, that they're doing with The Warning. Because that would, there's another one of those bands that's in the top tier of my favorite bands that I found. But I'm just going to have to sit here and pray that they come to the East Coast, the Southern East Coast, without going too far south, because I, I can only go so far. I can, you know, it costs money to, to travel to a concert. But I can't wait till they come back. I love this band. I cannot get enough of them. And yeah, that's, it's, they're just amazing. Um, so thank you, Bruno, for the, for the request, even though you didn't pick the specific song, you're bringing me back to Bandmade, and that's always a good thing. So thank you so much, Bruno. I really appreciate it. And let me switch over. And let's go. So Bandmade Memorable. Hold on. Why does this rock look like a dragon head? There's the eye, and that looks like an eye, right? Is is was that added for that for very purpose? Because that looks like a dragon, you know, a dragon's laying over here, and this is his head, and his eyes open. That's the first. As soon as the screen, the, the camera came over that hill, my eyes were right there on that. That looks like a dragon. Am I crazy? I may be crazy. It's not out of the realm that I'm absolutely insane, but that looks like a dragon head. <laughs> She's 
not exactly dressed with the footwear for a, <laughs> for a hike. <laughs> I'm so glad to see you again. Kono toki ga tsuzuku yo ni. Kurai hibi sae with you. Mu imi na mono wa nai yo. Shoot me down last night. I feel my heart lifted with you love. You love me. Okay, first of all, the the song is just beautiful. Um, Psyche's voice, unbelievably beautiful. It's crazy. When the rest of the band, when the band came in, you know, Misa is. I love what she does in slow songs because she's, since it's quieter and slower, she has she has this freedom to really do some great, beautiful but complicated work on her bass and it's just crazy how good it is um this is funny because i just talked about i've listened to the um their song hate so many times over the last you know few days if, and plus you know last several weeks and, you know ever since i watched the the new version of it and it's that song is so aggressively angry at the subject matter of that song, um, I've in the comments I've seen rumors of who it's about, so I'm, I don't know, so I'm not going to get into it. But it's so aggressive and angry, and I'm going to kill you. And now I'm listening to this absolutely beautiful love song, basically from what I've caught from the um, lyrics. It's the uh, you know complete 100% opposite of hey so this is a great contrast for what i've been listening from them so for so so much of the last couple of days and i love it it's beautiful absolutely beautiful i dream about your smile <laughs> Okay, I know I don't usually stop in Konami solos, but there was a really cool effect that just happened between Psyche and Konami. Um, Konami starts her, what I thought was gonna be the beginning of the solo, but then the note she played faded into Psyche's um, no, vocalization note. And it for a second there, I wasn't sure what was happening. It blended so well from the guitar to um, Psyche's voice. Beautiful, that was amazing. I really love that switch from the guitar to the voice. So good. I dream about you so good. Okay, that was great. It was like a punch in and out of that solo. Um, 
plus I heard like a backing track solo. So um, I'm assuming she did a cut like two different solos in this in studio, and they and basically harmonized and then come apart and harmonized. That they obviously have to use a backing track to get the second second part of that solo going in in a live setting, or they just change it change the solo in the live setting. But that was a really cool like you like I said in and out solo. She didn't go crazy. She didn't shred for like you know a minute, which would have been fine with me if she wanted to shred because I love how good of a guitar a guitarist she is. So good. Um, I haven't talked about um, Akane yet. Akane, this is the type of song I've I've mentioned it in others a lot. In, when I was doing their um, their uh, acoustic stuff, that you can tell she's having to hold back, and she's you know she's a super powerful you know monster on the drums that I love, and seeing her kind of pull herself back, and you can tell that she's holding back so that she's not overpowering the song. And it's really impressive that somebody who's that great of a power, that great and powerful of a drummer can do that. Pull it back and just be subtle. Don't, you know, don't beat the drums like crazy. Just keep it keep it nice and subdued. And it's and subdued in a great way. It, she's such an impressive drummer. Um and I also haven't mentioned Miku. Miku, um, I don't know how old the song is. I'm not. I know when the her, the early song, she wasn't really playing much guitar. Um, I think I did a an acoustic where they were sitting in the studio of some sort, and she was basically she was basically just using the drum the guitar as a percussion, and people mentioned were mentioning that it was a pro, you know jokingly that her guitar prop. And I know over the years she's, you know, Konami has worked with her and taught her more and more guitar, um, and she's become a great rhythm guitarist. Um, but I'm not sure. Like I said, I don't know about the time frame about this video. I don't know how much guitar she was playing for this at this time. But um, so I'm not sure about her guitar, her guitar playing. But I love other than like she's probably doing, you know, chords and stuff, which is great. Which is all this song needs really from the rhythm um i love her harmonies with psyche um she's she's got such a beautiful voice i did um a few days ago i did a uh um krupo song i'm going to try to pronounce it correctly you know the 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 japanese the l is more of an r sound so krupo um and i was talking about her voice in that and how much i love her more quiet subdued voice and it's such a great mix. It does such great harmonies with Psyche's power that they just, they're, they're, they're the perfect mix of voices. And I love it. I love it so much. And of course, Misa is just, Misa's Misa. Misa is everything. So, you know. I saw everybody knows wonder who are so i want to channel you tonight tonight yeah, yeah. i feel my heart Beautiful, and the the video was beautiful. Look at that. That's such a beautiful scenery. Just want to make sure there's nothing else. I mean, that's beautiful. That's a beautiful shot right there. Okay, so that was um, band made with memorable, great um, love song, great ballad. I loved it. Um, the video itself, the visuals, let's talk about that first with Miku out in the desert area with that sunlight on her. She looked beautiful. She is such an amazingly beautiful woman. 
and just with that sunlight on her and her hair that way, she's just, wow, she is absolutely stunning. Um, the During the concert footage, again, it was subdued. They weren't running around the stage. They were in their spot. They just playing this beautiful song and it works it works so well i really enjoyed this song i love a great ballad um and they did it amazingly it was great it was really really good i, pre I appreciate that bruno um i know you made me pick the song which you made me work for to, to try to find a song that wasn't already requested but you got me by doing that you made me get to this song and i I loved it. Thank you so much. You're you're a rock star. Thank you. I appreciate it. If you guys like this video, give it a like, comment, subscribe, hit the notification bell. Um, I really appreciate all y'all's support. It really does mean the world to me. Thank you, Bruno, and I will talk to you guys next time.